All right, this is a quick message for the Capricorn. I hope that it resonates, but it is general, so it may or may not. This is a timeless reading. So whenever you see it is when you see it. I do offer personal readings. Um, my link is in the description box below. And um, what was I finna say? Oh, I'm gonna tell you what you need to hear, not what you want to hear, okay? Okay. Let's see. Capricorn. What messages do you have for the Capricorn? Let's be okay, sheets. All right. All right, so you got the Ace of Cups in reverse, the Two of Wands, and the Three of Swords. Okay, so you got one, two, and three, which is very interesting. Um, So there's like a process happening here, and I feel like to a certain extent, you need to allow it to happen. But I feel like a lot of you, like a uh, situation didn't really work out for you, something that did make you happy or fulfill you, or you thought it was going to fulfill you and make you happy, and it just kind of disintegrated to in some form whether it was like someone who left your life or you thought something was gonna work like pull through but it didn't or something like that and I feel like you guys are kind of in this process now where you're waiting for it to um come back to fortition and the way like it was or the way that you expected it to be before it just suddenly cut itself out of your life um but i feel like that's only going to result into more pain okay you got the sacral chakra in reverse with the power card which is the strength card um i feel like a lot of you are not listening to what your body is telling you what your feelings are telling you. You have to understand that our emotions are our navigational system. They're not meant to be ignored or to be dwelled into. They just simply offer you the information that you need in order to move accordingly. That's it. Okay. So um a lot of y'all are not listening to way to the way that y'all feel. And I feel like some of y'all can feel like damn the situation is just not going to offer me what I want or just then whatever, whatever. And y'all still hoping and waiting that it's going to come back and do exactly what your body, what your feelings is telling you. It's not. You got the four of cups in reverse. So I don't see anything being offered here based upon this. And I feel like even if it did, it wouldn't even be something to fulfill you. And that's what you're not seeing. I feel like whatever the situation is, you only had a little taste of it. You had a little taste. You didn't really get the full extent. Like you, you were on the like you got the the good out of it. You didn't see the bad and the ugly. And if you had, you would be like, oh, uh, uh, I'm good, I'm good. But because you didn't, and because you got the fairy tale end of it, whatever the situation is, um, you you just want it to come back. You hoping to come back, come back round, um, to offer you this fulfillment. Some of you, this could have been like a business opportunity that just didn't work out and it was supposed to be a lot of money in it or something, but you didn't realize the person that offered it to you was a scammer or something, you know, or they was they was into some stuff. You would have got entangled with them. You would have been in some legal trouble. This could have been a person that you was talking to that talked up a real good game and made you feel real good, but you ain't know that they was addicted to drugs. Um, this could be, you know, it's just, you just didn't see the whole thing. That's yeah. You didn't see it. You didn't see the whole thing. And that's why, um, that's why honey, you waiting. Cause you, I mean, it, honey, I'm telling you if, the, if it did come back and you got it and you got it for real, you would not want it. You would not want it. You would not. You would not want it. I guarantee it. Whatever this is. Um, yeah, you got the six of wands with the eight of swords in reverse. Or the what? The six of wands in reverse with the eight of swords. So, yeah, y'all just in your own imaginations, worldfications about what it could have been. And not seeing it for what it really was. That she was being protected from something. And that whatever this was, wasn't going to turn out, wasn't going to pan out the way that she wanted it to pan out. That's just the truth. That's just, that's just the truth of the situation. It's just the truth. 
you got the throat chakra in verse. So something wasn't being communicated. The truth was not being communicated. It, it was not, somebody was not telling the whole truth in a in this situation. Okay, you was presented with some bull crap. That's why, yeah, see, lying, just lying. I, and whatever, I feel like it's not even lying. I just feel like somebody was leaving details out, very important details that would have definitely not have you sitting here waiting for this situation, okay? If you would have gotten these details. You got the Empress card. Let me see, what's that about? Ooh, that's too many cards. Give me one more card. What's the Empress card about? Look, I, one, please. Thank you. Got the Six of Wands reverse with the Empress. Um, some of y'all could have an unexpected pregnancy. That's making you feel like you can't move on from this situation. That's just for a very select few of y'all. Um, but I feel like you're really going to be able to move on once you, intuition, once you listen to your emotions, once you listen, once you use your navigational system, I feel like that's when you will be able to move on. When you look at it from a higher perspective instead of what it could have offered you and like the lower wants and needs of the situation, I feel like you'll be able to see without having seen the whole picture that you are worth more than this situation. I feel like that's what will help you to mentally move on from it because I feel like that's what's holding you is that you haven't fully gotten an overall perspective of the situation just the things that you wanted or the things that um, you felt like would feel good in this particular situation. But once you use your internal dialogue and push that energy up into your intuition, or it's, I mean, it's technically there because that's why the emotions is your internal navigation system. But that's besides the point. Um, I feel like then you'll be able to change your perspective. Then you'll be able to move on. Okay, so I hope this helps.